G'day. Let's talk about the insanity of signs that ban involuntary behavior. One of the parks that I pass through on my morning walk has a bunch of signs up banning a whole bunch of behaviors. There's a sign that says no smoking, no drinking, no gambling, no durian, which if you're not from Asia, you really wouldn't understand. And part of that sign says no vomiting. And every time I look at it, I ask myself, are they trying to be funny or are they seriously thinking that people can choose not to vomit? I mean, all of those other behaviors are voluntary. I can understand that. No smoking, I get it. No drinking, well, things can get messy. No gambling, fair enough, that can get messy. No durian, again, if you're not from Asia, you probably don't understand. But nobody gets up in the morning and says, great, Saturday morning, let's get off to the park and have a good old vomit. It's not something that is voluntary. And so what is the point, and I'm genuinely asking this question because I'm mystified by it. What is the point of trying to ban involuntary behavior? It just escapes me. I still can't understand where the logic is. I understand if you're saying no vomiting to discourage people from drinking and getting sick, but there's a sign that already says no drinking, so that's okay, I would have thought, that's covered. So I don't get it. I would generally like to know from anybody who understands the logic of a sign that bans involuntary behavior, let me know if you know of any other involuntary behavior banning signs that are out there. Let me know if you've ever seen any, and let me know if you can think of any possible reason why you would bother putting up a sign to ban vomiting. Don't get it. Alrighty, that is it for today. I do thank you for your time and I will be back again tomorrow. See ya.